Welcome to Casey's SEO. Today, I'm gonna to show you guys a couple different plugins for WordPress that you guys can use for redirecting links. So this is one of the most common issues that I see with websites. They will create a page, they will delete that page, and then it goes to pretty much nowhere. Sometimes they don't even have a 404 page set up. So if this is you or you need help with this situation, let's hop over to the computer and I'm gonna show you guys three different plugins that you guys can use for redirects. In order to get plugins, you're gonna to have to log into your WordPress, click on the plugins tab, click add new, and then you will type in either all 404 pages redirect to homepage. Now this is the easiest and simplest way to add a redirect back to your page so you don't have any 404s. All redirects though are going to go back to the homepage and I really only suggest to use this plugin if you have lots and lots or hundreds of different uh, broken URLs that you need redirected and then you will wanna come back and use a different plugin to try to redirect those pages back to a specific page related to the page that you broke. The next plugin that we're gonna be looking at is the redirection plugin. So if you just type in redirection, you will find the plugin. In order to add redirects for this plugin, you will open that plugin up, hit redirects, and then in the source URL, you will be typing in the URL that is broke or the page that you removed. From there, you're gonna scroll down to the target URL and then paste in the URL that you want that page to redirect to. If you hit the settings button, you will see some different options for your redirect. So we have a 301 redirect, we have a 302, a 303, a 304, a 307, and a 308 option. This plugin is really easy and really good to use. Uh, if you do use a redirect, there will all, you will see the URL up here and then there will be a button where you can test to make sure that the URL did work. I highly suggest you test the URL, um, even get off of the backend, log in uh, incognito, test that URL and just double check and make sure that works. The last plugin that you can use is the Yoast SEO plugin. Now this is for the premium version, but if you have the premium version, you can hit the redirects tab. From there, you can uh, figure out what type of URL or redirect that you want. Is it a 301 or 302, 307, 410, or a 451? So there are some different options on here. Generally, you're just gonna go with the 301, but you might want to look in some different type of redirects for other situations. But this one's still very easy to use. You just hit add redirect, put your old URL in, your new URL, and then hit add redirect, and it's done. There you go. There was three different plugins that you guys can use to help you with your redirects. Remember that all 404 page redirect pl plugin is really only good for kind of a backup. So if you have hundreds of URLs that are broken, you can use that plugin, then come back with a different plugin for your actual redirects. If you guys know any other plugins that work great for redirects, maybe that provide you some different options or somehow it's just easier to use, please let me know. But until then, make sure you hit that subscribe button for more daily SEO tips.